Hi, I am Anita Krishnan. I am in a leadership role at Biocon Research Center in Chennai. I have always been a technical leader. Biocon has given me this unique opportunity to be a step above it. Uh, I am happy to share this vision of creating a new R&D center in Chennai. It really makes me happy to take an R&D center from its inception all the way to a biosimilar product. In this role, I am responsible to recruit and build a team and nurture the young biotechnologists towards biosimilar product development. I was always very good in science in school and imagined myself with a white lab coat. Uh, I did not get the opportunity to pursue research right after post-graduation as would most people do. I was married to an Air Force officer and uh, had to travel along with him. As soon as we were married, we were posted in very remote places like Jorat in Assam and uh, Leh in Ladakh. I always used to teach science wherever we were posted. It was very fulfilling to teach science to young kids. And then when we were posted in Leh one fine day with no internet or library resources, I decided to take on the CSER and GATE exams. And to everybody's surprise and uh, perhaps to my surprise as well, that I cleared the exam with a fellowship, which gave me entry into a nationally acclaimed lab. Uh, once into PhD, I realized that uh, my fellow PhD students were a lot younger than me and they were more hands-on. Uh, which really made me play the catch-up game. But my fundamentals were always strong and I was a voracious reader. And my fellow PhD students were also very supportive. In my PhD, I was a trained mass spectrometrist working on the proteomics workflow, which helped me gain uh, an entry into the biosimilar world. Once into the biosimilar world, I started off with uh, mass spec characterization of proteins and later diversified into end-to-end uh, -end analytics, hardcore analytics. As an analytical scientist, I get this unique opportunity of looking at the product quality uh, throughout the product development cycle. I'm happy to be an analytical scientist who's the product lens for every process scientist. Further into my career, I got the opportunity of leading a biosimilar program all the way up to regulatory filing and approval. This role made me don multiple hats uh, the pressure was huge, uh, but it was an arduous and very enriching experience. I am really thankful to the leadership uh, which had immense faith in me to deliver this product. Family is always the best support that you can have. Uh, to me, my father was a great source of inspiration. Um, in fact, to me, he was a visionary who prioritized education for two little daughters with his humble earnings. If you're aspiring for science, you need to have an attitude to face failures with a positive and a logical mind, and you need to be a learner throughout your career in science. My advice to young scientists would be to focus on a specific area, develop yourself, gain enough knowledge, and make yourself an expert in that area before you actually diversify into other techniques. I think women have a right to pamper themselves. It's important to know what really appeals to you and there's no harm in following it. You may not satisfy everybody in the world, but uh, end of the day, I think you need to be true to yourself. It's very important to be that way.